hello everyone welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a timu video so in my last video i did do a haul if you are new to timu guys check them out um they are a site that sells so many different things you can find clothing beauty skin skin stuff um i don't know footwear clothing craft supplies whatever you can think of whatever you can buy at a store you can snatch at timu for a really good price you get um free shipping and there it's really easy to return things as well so guys make sure you check them out if you are a new user if you've never tried timu download the app use my code it will be listed down below and you will receive a hundred dollars and free items you guys my friends have done it um i had to jump on the bad wagon and work with them but it definitely definitely is legit it works go check it out if you are a new user download that app you guys and then also if you are a new user make sure you guys use my code at checkout because i think you'll get 50 percent off your entire purchase if you decide to purchase something um and that's going to be changing i believe december the first is going to be 30 percent off so definitely make sure that you guys use that code if you've never used timu before and you are new use that app you guys so you can get a hundred dollars in coupons and then you'll get 50 percent off for we're at the end of the november so you got to use it quickly um but december the first it will be 30 percent off okay so enough of that um i will have everything listed down below i wanted to share these with you guys if you are not new to my channel you um have seen the tutorial for these but if you haven't if you missed it i picked up a bunch of things from timu they'll be listed down below for you guys and one of the things that i grabbed are these cute little ornaments you guys they're so cute they're supposed to be like shot glasses for you to pour drinks in but when i saw them i had to have them i, I wanted to do a sequin mix in, inside of an ornament and the sizes were just too big everywhere. So when I saw these on Timu, I had to snatch you guys. They remind me of some that were at the Target dollar spot some years ago. And they're just the perfect size. So as you can see, I got a really pretty sequins mix here. And I just altered it. So I'll have this video listed down below as well. In case you guys want to check it out and see how to do this. You do get a pack of 10. They're really inexpensive. Hit the links down below. Guys, stuff on Timu, it sells out so quickly. You have to make sure that... If you see something you like, you check out quickly, okay, and grab it. Okay, the next project shares. I play with some of these dyes, you guys. First of all, let's start with this one. This girl, she is so cute. I was so excited to put her together. And I'm not a huge fan of paper piecing, you guys. And I did not want to cut all these pieces. This is what the die looks like. Let me show you guys again. I did not want to cut these in a bunch of different colors. So I went ahead and i cut it out of white cardstock and then i used my alcohol ink markers to put her together guys look at how cute she is she's so adorable i think i went a little crazy with the white highlights but she's still so cute guys look at her afro i'm so in love with her hair it's just so beautiful she has beautiful hair cute little jacket and you can make this dye easily christmas halloween whatever you can put like a santa's hat you can do some snowflakes in the background. You can put a peppermint in her hand. The possibilities are endless. And guys, check out the link down below because there's actually different options of her. There's different um, little girls. And I just picked this one. I'm going to have to grab some more of the other ones. Look at how cute she is. She's so adorable. So let me know what you think about her. And then I also was able to put together this die. So I just cut those two dies out. And it also has like another piece. Here it goes. The little popsicle piece. And I went ahead and put some of those. I did the same thing, guys. I cut it out of white cardstock. And I just used my alcohol ink markers and colored in the pieces. And this is what it looks like. This is the cupcake. Look at the little cookie, though. Oh, my God. The cookie. I'm so obsessed with the cookies, you guys. They're the perfect little tiny embellishment size. And then here's the star. So cute. So again, I use my alcohol ink markers and I just use my white gel pen. And I just did like some little frosting or little highlights. And then I also did this. I think it's like a marshmallow stick or something. 
But let me put a little white highlight. It is so cute, guys. This die set is so adorable. I can't wait to put the other ones together. But how cute is that? So cute. You can even put that in her hand. You see what I mean? Like, she is adorable, guys. Snatch all these little girls. I have to collect them as well. And I think I want to cut a bunch of these little cookies and create embellishments. So, I just wanted to show those cut out and made up for you guys. And then the third die that I'm going to play with, we're going to put it together. Together. Is this die here. Let me move this stuff out the way. It is this one. It's a little fry box. It's so tiny, guys, and cute. But it comes with these little pieces to make it a Santa with a belt. Or you can make it an elf with a belt. So I went ahead and I cut this out. And I thought it would be fun to piece it together with you guys. I just went ahead and cut the Santa. I did white cardstock. And then I'm using my this collection that I'm playing with. Okay. So guys, take advantage. If you've never um, shopped with Timu, you never downloaded that app. Take advantage of those coupons because I'm jelly. I need them coupons too. Okay. $100 in coupons and 30% off. I need that ASAP. Okay, I'm getting my bone folder. And this fry box is super easy to put together. You just fold the lines. These would be really cute. This die is a perfect size for little party favors. To throw in a couple little candies. I think it'll be so cute. Especially for like a classroom or a party. Or a birthday. And you don't have to use the pieces that make it Christmas. You can just use the fry box. <laughs> I was trying to keep that sneeze in guys. Excuse me. And you're just going to glue these two pieces together. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry, you guys got to hear me sneezing. So let's see. I'm trying to see if they go like all the way or just some. I'm going to glue it some. So I'm going to put glue here. And I love that the fry box is just one piece. You know what I mean? So there goes that side. You guys tell me what other things you think that you can fit on here. In here. Like crafty wise. You might be able to fit maybe some stickles, a little spray. Like a little mist for you, maybe? Look at how tiny and cute this is, you guys. I have, I own a couple of fry boxes, and this is the smallest size that I've seen. And it is adorable. I'm in love with it. All right, let's put this here. This is going to be Santa's little collar. Look at how cute. So cute, guys. And then this is the belt. It has these little holes for you to thread. Here, let's see how this goes. Okay. Like that, I think. I'm trying to see if it goes this way or that way. It's so little, you guys. I'm going to me measure this out for you all. Do I need to go lower? Yeah, like right there. Maybe even lower. Maybe. Right there. 
All right. So you take this piece and you are gonna weave it through here. How cute, you guys. You gotta cut this out of glitter. I'm just using white and pink to kind of match. Coordinate with the collection I'm playing with. There we go. And it just slides right through. Look at how cute that is. Oh my God, it's so adorable. So I'm gonna put this like low, low. Yeah, like right there. Look at how cute that is, you guys. Oh my God, it's so cute. I have to make a bunch of these and take a cute little picture. But let me know down in the comment section below, what would you gift in here? So I'm just gonna put a little bit of glue. That belt is so cute in the collar. And boom, there goes your little fry box. Let's see how big this is. It measures like one and three quarters. And then let's see how tall it is. Two and a half, a little over two and a half. So cute, you guys. Look at all that room in there. Let's see what we can fit in here. Um, you know, I always got some things around my desk. Here goes some of those pops of color. You can definitely fit one of those in there. It's a little bit big. Stickles will probably fit perfectly. But I will put little goodies in here, like a little baggie of like gems or, you know, something like that and stuff it and have like the tissue popping up. I think that would be really cute, guys. How adorable is this little box? So that's it for this video. I didn't want to do too long of a video. I got a lot of stuff going on. But I wanted to jump on here and show you guys what these look like. I actually placed another order. I've been going crazy with Timu, guys. I'm addicted. I've been buying clothes for my... My daughter picked out some stuff. I picked out some more crafty items um, that I bought with my own money. Uh, um, so I will be showing that in uh, the next video that I do for them, okay? So make sure you guys check out my little haul. How cute are these cookies? I just want to make a bunch of these. I have to make a ton and make embellishments. All right. So let me know down below what you guys think of these items. And again, I will have this tutorial link down below for you guys. Snatch these ornaments. They are a great size to gift and stuff like that. It's too big for this. Look at this fry box. Oh my God, it's so cute. All right. That's all for this video, guys. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye, everyone.